As a general user, i.e. without a Dataverse account, you would be able to access and download any files from Dataverses that have been made public. However, to be able to access restricted files or create your own Dataverse, you will need a Dataverse account. This short video demonstrates how to create an account and how to create a Dataverse. From the home page of the Dataverse Network site, thedata.org, click the link to IQSS Dataverse Network. From this page, click the link to create account. Complete the form, noting that items marked with an asterisk are compulsory. The username must be unique. When you click the Create Account button, the system will check to see whether a user with that name already exists. If it does already exist, you should try a different name, not forgetting to retype the password, which will have cleared. We won't show you the whole process as we already have an account. The next step will be to read and agree to the terms of use. Once that is done, you will have an account and be able to create your own Dataverse. From the IQSS site, click on Create a Dataverse, then complete the form. For the type of Dataverse, choose Scholar if you are working alone. The Dataverse will include your name and extra fields will appear for you to enter this. If working in a team, choose Basic. Most Dataverses will be of the basic type. Enter your affiliation and a name for the Dataverse. Then give a short alias. This will become part of the URL. For example, we chose SSC UK, and this is now the final component of the URL for our Dataverse. This alias will need to be unique. The system will check this when you click Save, and if there is a conflict, you will need to choose something else. There is obviously a conflict here as we have already created this Dataverse. Note also that the home page description is limited to 255 characters. Under classification, you can choose one or more option. These are basically to help users to find your Dataverse. Any of the settings for the Dataverse can be changed later on. Go into your Dataverse and click the link to Options. Then go to the Dataverse Settings tab and choose the link for Edit General Settings. Be careful about changing the alias though, as this will change the URL for your Dataverse and may break any links that currently exist to this page. Once you have a Dataverse, you can start to load studies into it. With a user account, you can add comments to studies where this option is set, request access to restricted files and even add studies to some types of open Dataverses.